determinants of a minus lambda i equal to 0 which is known as characteristic equation of any square matrix where lambda i equal to constants any constants okay and roots of this equation is known as ion values characteristic roots and latent roots right so after learning this concept, we will be able to find inverse of any matrix. Okay? And what which type of question asked in universities or any competition exams like a to the power 6 plus 5, A to the power 4 plus 5 plus 3, A to the power 4, A cube plus A square plus A plus 5. What is the value of it? Okay. University asks, what is the value of this? By using Kyle Hamilton theorem or asking what is the inverse of any matrix by using Kyle Hamilton theorem? This type of problems we will solve in this lecture. Okay. So everyone, in this lecture, before learning the Kyle Hamilton theorem, we will be learning what is the characteristic portion. Okay. Let's start. Characteristic equation. Okay. If we have any square matrix, if a square matrix A square matrix A and I the identity identity matrix of same order then Determinants of lambda i time a minus lambda i that is equal to zero. This concept is known as characteristic equation of any matrix. Right? Lambda is any constant. Right? After the solving this equation, we have value of lambda. Then, this value of lambda is shown as characteristic roots or latent roots or eigen values. Okay? Note it, guys. For example, A is the 
स्क्वायर मैट्रिक्स टू फाइव फोर एंड आई टी करेक्टरिस्टिक सुपोर्शन Solving this equation, we have to find what the roots of this equation. Okay, so two minus lambda into five minus lambda minus zero to five equal to zero. Right. So <coughs> five into two ten minus two lambda minus five lambda. Minus minus plus lambda square that is equal to zero. Now this equation is converted into quadratic equation. Now I will know how to find this quadratic equation. Okay, lambda square minus seven lambda. Okay, plus ten that is equal to zero. Right. Now lambda. Square minus five lambda minus two lambda plus ten that is equal to zero and lambda minus five minus two bracket uh, by lambda minus five that is equal to zero and <coughs> lambda equal to sorry lambda minus two lambda minus This value is known as characteristic roots, right? And latent roots are eigen values, right? So this concept applies this process, okay? By this process. Now we will move the Kelly Hamilton theorem, right? What is Kelly Hamilton theorem? Any square matrix which satisfies its own characteristic equation that is known as Kelly Hamilton theorem. This is the statement of Kelly Hamilton theorem, right? <coughs> statement what is the statement of coil hamilton theorem if any square matrix e right any square matrix e satisfy
its own characteristics equation right this is the statement of kyle hamilton theorem right now <coughs> like the concept of kyle hamilton theorem now we will move the questions okay <coughs> how to solve this how to solve the problem by the kyle hamilton theorem right verify this question okay verify right also you will do it also you will do it at the power 6 minus 6 a to the power 5 plus 9 a to the power 4 minus 2 a to the power q minus 12 a square plus 23 a minus nine, nine, right this is the question now apply the kyle hamilton theorem and verify the kyle hamilton theorem and uh, by using the kyle hamilton theorem we will uh, out of uh, we will find the a inverse of uh, this matrix right so also find the i uh, also we will uh, evaluate this <coughs> okay evaluate this <coughs> equation okay now also we will find uh, the value of this expression right <coughs> now first of all we will solve this verify the kyle hamilton theorem of this matrix right so <coughs> we will uh, find the characteristics rules right and uh, characteristic question of this equation e minus lambda as we know of same order that is 3 cross 3 right so lambda into 1 0 0 
जीरो वन जीरो 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 वन नाउ सॉल्व दिस इक्वेशन Now solve this determinants two minus lambda. Now we need this row and this column and solve with this matrix, right? Now <coughs> two minus lambda that is the whole square, right? Or minus minus plus. Minus one, right? Minus minus one, and B leave this column and this row. This column and this row. That is, I I solve this problem. That is cross matrix, right? So. Minus two minus lambda and minus and minus plus one, right? And <coughs> after this one plus, we leave this column and this row and remaining the determinant this, right? Minus minus plus and one or minus two minus that is equal to zero, right? <coughs> now two uh, two minus lambda four plus lambda square minus four lambda minus one minus minus plus minus two plus lambda minus one right plus one minus two plus lambda that is equal to zero right now <coughs> two minus lambda lambda square Minus four lambda plus three plus lambda minus one and plus lambda minus one that is equal to zero, right? So <coughs> two lambda square minus eight lambda minus uh, plus six, right? And minus lambda cube plus Four lambda square, right? And minus three lambda plus two lambda minus two that is equal to zero, right? So <coughs> after solving this equation, we have to find characteristic roots, right? So <coughs> minus lambda q. And this had highest power of lambda. So first of all, write this lambda, right? And after the write this lambda, and uh, we will write uh, 
second power of the lambda that is 4 plus 2 that is equal to plus 6 lambda square and after this 3 minus 3 plus 2 minus 1 and minus 9 lambda right Six minus two that is plus four. Four. That's equal to zero, right? Now, at <coughs> now we will apply a uh, Galen-Hamilton theorem in this equation, right? What is the Galen-Hamilton theorem? Galen-Hamilton theorem says that if any square matrix A, any square matrix A satisfy its own characteristics equation right so this is the characteristics equation of the net matrix right so <coughs> now this equation is converted into a cube plus 6 a square minus 9 a plus 4 i that is equal to So this is Kyle Hamilton theorem concept, right? <coughs> now we will find uh, the inverse of that matrix, right? So <coughs> how to find the inverse? B will uh, multiply on both side by A inverse, right? So, <coughs> multiply lie on both side by A inverse, right? So, <coughs> minus A inverse A cube plus 6 A inverse a square minus 9 a inverse a plus 4 a inverse i equal to 0 right a inverse into 0 right so <coughs> that is a square minus a square plus 6 a minus 9 i plus 4 a inverse that is equal to 0 right Four A inverse is equal to A square minus six A plus nine I right now A inverse equal to one by four A square minus six A plus nine I right this is the A inverse now we will find the a square of that matrix and 6a and plus 9 i then the, uh, all these matrix divided by 4 that is that will be a inverse of that square matrix right so now we will solve uh, find the a inverse right <coughs> so <coughs> first of all we will find a square right two minus one one minus one 1, 2 minus 1, 1 minus 1, 2, right, 2 minus 1, 1, minus 1, 2 minus 1, 1 minus 1, right, so <coughs> we will solve this square matrix, right, 
This is also right because we have find the uh, value of a inverse, right? So <coughs> we will write here, right? Uh, inverse equal to 1 by 4 a square minus 6 a plus 9 i, right? Now a square equal to six minus five plus five minus five six minus five five minus five six right now we will uh, find the a q by using the sorry in this equation highest uh, power of the matrix A that is 2 so <coughs> we have to need only A square right not A cube so we have to find minus 6A right what is the value of A 2 minus 1 1 minus 1 2 minus 1 1 minus 1 and 2 right now we have uh, to multiply it by minus 6, right? Sorry, 6 only. Into 6a equal to 6 into 2, 12 minus 6 plus 6 minus 6, 12 minus 6, 6 minus 6 and 12. This is 6a, right? 
and nine into i i note it right can i tell okay Six minus five pi minus five six and minus five right. This is the a square. This is square. Six minus five pi minus five six minus five minus five minus five, uh, plus five six right. No. Nine. Add it to it is one zero 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 one zero 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 one right that is equal to nine zero 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 nine zero 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 nine right nine i we have the all the values of matrix right nine a a square six a and nine i right so <coughs> by using these uh, expression we will find value of n mass right so <coughs> uh, this is the fit and a square what is the value of square? 6 minus 5 i minus 5, 6 minus 5, 5 minus 5 and 6, right? And uh, minus 6 minus 12, minus 6, 6, minus 6, 12 minus 6, 6 minus 6, 12, right? And plus 9, I. Nine zero 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 nine zero 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 nine. Right. <coughs> now after solving this, this is a square minus six a plus nine i equal to right. So <coughs> Six, uh, sorry, six plus nine, fifteen minus twelve. That is equal to three, right? Minus five, right? Or plus six, one, five, minus six, minus one, and minus one, right? Minus five, plus six, right? One. And six minus twelve minus six, right? Six minus twelve, uh, six plus nine, fifteen minus twelve, right? Three minus five plus six, that is one, and five uh, minus six minus one minus five plus six minus uh, right equal to one, and six minus twelve minus six. Minus 6 and plus 3, right? 6, 9, 15 and minus 12, that is equal to 3 and minus 5, right? Minus 5 plus 6, that is equal to 1 and 5, uh, 5 minus 6 minus 1, right? And minus 5 plus 6, 1 and 3, right? Now, 1 by 4. Uh, 1 by 4 a square minus 6a plus 9i that is equal to uh, 3 1 minus 1 1 3 1 minus 1 1 3 right so <coughs> that is equal to this is the a inverse right This 
asymptomatic uh, and was correct matrix right now we will find the <coughs> value of that expression that is given in the equation right so <coughs> This is A inverse and right. Now we will find the value of A to the power six minus five six into A to the power five. Plus nine a to the power four minus two a cube minus twelve a square plus twenty three a minus nine i right. Now we will find the value of this equation right by using the Hamilton theorem right. So <coughs> we will remind the uh, equation of the characteristic equation right so <coughs> what is the uh, equation of characteristics right equation uh, characteristic equation that that is that is equal to a cube minus 6 a square plus 9 a minus 4 and right we will find the value of this expression by using this concept right <coughs> now we have to find a uh, common we have to common a cube right in this equation expression and the remaining part a cube minus 6 a square plus 9a minus 2 I have to write minus 12a square plus 23a minus 9 I have to write now we will make this expression the same as this expression right because if we make this expression is the same as this expression then it this value is equal to zero and we will remaining this part and we, now after this find this value of this expression by using this equation right so <coughs> a cube a cube minus six a square plus nine a here minus two and here minus four we will make the value here uh, minus four and how to make this uh, minus 4 minus 2i minus 2i plus 2i minus 2i plus 2i that is equal to 0 and this the, does not affect this, uh, affect this expression right so minus 2i uh, plus 2i uh, we will make the 4i right because in this equation uh, uh, is present minus 4i right so minus remaining part minus 12 a square plus 23 a minus 9i right so <coughs> a cube a cube minus 6a square plus 9a minus 4i plus 2i minus 12a square plus 23a minus 9i right so this value uh, is equal to 0 because the characteristic question this of the matrix that is equal to zero so <coughs> due to this equation this expression that is equal to zero so a cube break in this bracket zero minus sorry plus two i minus twelve a square plus twenty three a minus 9 i write so here we will multiply the, uh, by a cube into 2 iota 
to iota sorry iota not iota this is identity matrix right so 2 a cube minus 12 a square right and uh, 23 a minus 9 i right now we will uh, make this expression right is same as this expression right so <coughs> We have two common two, right? Not two, but uh, yes, a cube plus a cube minus six a square minus six a square, right? Plus nine a plus fourteen a minus four a i i minus i right so a q minus 6 a square right plus 9 a and minus 4 i right and plus a q minus 6 a square right plus 14a minus 5i right and this value expression is 0 right so now we will move the next step right so we have a q minus 6a square plus 14a and then minus i i right so <coughs> a q minus 6 a square we have a q minus 6 a square plus 9 a plus uh, 5 a minus i i right 4 i minus i right now this expression sorry a q minus 6 a square plus 9 a minus 4 i plus 5 i a right minus i this expression has 0 so plus 5 a minus i 5 into remaining part is 5a right minus i right so <coughs> now uh, 5 into matrix is minus 1 2 minus 1 right sorry 2 minus 1 1 minus 1 2 minus 1 right 1 minus 1 2 right minus identity matrix of because this matrix is 3 cross 3 matrix then so we have will uh, use the identity matrix of 3 cross 3 matrix order right so 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 right so <coughs> 5 into 10 now 5 into 2 into 10 uh, that is equal to 10 minus 5 uh, plus 5 minus 5 10 minus 5 5 minus 5 and 10 minus 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 what right now <coughs> we will move the next step right we will reach the dest uh, our destination right 
uh, this is a third question so 10 minus 1 right 9 and uh, remaining part the same minus 5 5 minus 5 only change the value of this diagonal element right so <coughs> minus 5 9 <coughs> five, sorry 5 minus 5 and 9 right so value of that expression is equal to this matrix right see this is matrix is 3 plus 3 matrix right this is our answer this is the concept of element method right so i remind you key points of this concept first of all you have to make a uh, characteristic equation of given square matrix right after that you satisfied the, the uh, this characteristic equation uh, by uh, given uh, square matrix right so after that uh, you can easily solve this problem right it is the lengthy pro pro problem right but it, it doesn't mean it is tough problem right if you know all the processes step by step then you can easily solve this problem right <coughs> so please uh, guys if you fail this lecture beneficial right so you can please 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 subscribe my channel and like and share as much as possible right so <coughs> till then bye bye